During the recent RIMS conference in New Orleans, we spoke with Mary Rose Reeston about developments in the diagnosis of soft tissue injuries, the root cause of many workers' comp claims, which can be very expensive. Mary Rose is Chief Scientific Officer and founder of Emerge Diagnostics, a company at the forefront of something called Electrodiagnostic Functional Assessment. She joins us now from the Emerge Diagnostics office. Mary, welcome to the programme. Thank you for having me. Explain for us from a patient's perspective, what is an EFA test? An EFA test is the diagnostic tool for soft tissue injuries. And when we say soft tissue injury, we mean muscle strain, neck strain, rotator cuff tear, back pain. It is a combination of significantly advanced EMG technology with range of motion and a functional assessment all rolled into one that is non-loading, -lo non non-invasive, so the patient can't hurt themselves. How is the test conducted? It's like an EKG for your muscles. It's little pads that are placed on the muscle groups in question and you go through rest and a series of range of motions to see how the muscle functions at rest with usage and in combination with muscle groups and bilateral sides to look at how the muscles are functioning, if they're functioning appropriately and if there's fatigue when you return to rest. Why are patients hesitant to have the test? I think they're not hesitant to have the test. It's lack of appropriate information. Um, the EFA has been proven to be the better choice for diagnosis of back pain to rule out structure, muscle pathology, and better yet to get the right treatment to make the patient better, faster, and return to activities of daily living. What are the benefits? The benefits are number one, you can actually know where your problem is emanating from, what side, what affects your problem, what medication to take, what physical therapy you need to take to get rehab faster so it's not a, sh a shotgun approach, it's a very specific approach. And we found through the many years that we've been doing it is better patient outcomes that people actually are thanking us for returning them back to health. What's the next step in the development of EFAs? Great question. We are actually working um, to refine the technology to actually pick up much more information about the muscles and be able to inevitably have a home use uh, associated with physical therapy to monitor your compliance. Mary, thanks for joining us. Thank you very much. If you'd like more information on new trends in soft tissue injuries and diagnosis, visit the Emerge Diagnostics website or the RIN TV On Demand Library.